Greetings to you colleagues, students, and all members of the UCT community. It is with a heavy heart that I speak to you today to convey the sad news of the passing of former UCT Vice-Chancellor, Professor Stuart Saunders. He passed away on the 12th of February, 2021, after being ill for some time. Professor Saunders served the university exceptionally well for a remarkable 15 years holding the role of Vice-Chancellor from 1981 until 1996. A former professor of medicine at UCT, he has remained an active part of the UCT family in various ways. The most recent is through the annual Dr. Stuart Saunders lecture held in his honor annually for the past two years. Professor Saunders led UCT for the most part during the darkest days of apartheid. It was under his venerated leadership that UCT's residences were open to students of all races. This move not only challenged the status quo during a time of segregation, but it also created the space for intellectual debates in an intolerant society. He is also regarded as being among those who played a role in putting an end to the racially segregated training of medical registrars. He played a leading role in driving the university's policy to provide education of international excellence and to be a leading research university. He will further always be remembered for initiating fundraising efforts among South African universities to ensure their academic freedom. In 2002, Professor Saunders was awarded the Order of the Baobab in silver, a national honor for South Africans for their distinguished service to their country. This spoke volumes considering his immeasurable contribution to higher education. A physician by training, his cutting edge medical research was recognized by no less than seven local and international universities, which conferred honorary degrees on him. In the early 1990s, he established the UCT Trust in the United Kingdom and served as its board member post his time as Vice-Chancellor, illustrating his unwavering commitment to the institution. Over a period of two decades, Professor Saunders played an instrumental role within the trust, spreading UCT's name in the UK specifically and in most parts of Europe. In his role as board member, he forged meaningful relationships and helped the trust to raise millions for the university from foundations, companies, alumni, and friends. He retired from the board of the UCT Trust in May 2012, a year after celebrating his 80th birthday. Regarded as one of the university's most committed and called upon supporters, Professor Saunders also served as president of the UCT Heritage Society. He founded the society in the mid 90s to honor alumni and friends who had left a legacy, a bequest or provision to the university in their wills. Professor Saunders also authored a book titled Vice Chancellor on a Tightrope, a personal account of climactic years in South Africa. The book title is a reference to the balancing act he had to perform whilst leading the institution through those turbulent and tumultuous years in our country. Professor Saunders' contribution to the institution, the medical field, the higher education sector, and to society at large will always bear testimony to the great man that he was. It is not possible to reflect fully on his legacy, his involvement with the institution, and the many roles that he has held within and outside the university, and do justice to this in just a few words. The Communication and Marketing Department will therefore be publishing further content reflecting on and celebrating his life in the next few days. This will be published on a dedicated feature page paying tribute to Professor Saunders. We convey our heartfelt condolences to his children, Jane and John, and the entire Saunders family and to those who knew or worked with him. May his soul rest in peace.